Steve Morning, yeah. massive game. We're up against arguably the most popular Sunday league team in the country. How do you see this one going? Good morning to you. Yeah, great game. Looking forward to it. They're the most popular team, but we're very popular as well. That's part and parcel of the fun. <laughs> yeah, semi-final. Uh, we've been there before, so yeah. Just uh, get ready to enjoy it. You've been at this stage last season. Unfortunately, you come up short in the final. How important is this competition for you guys after this great season that you've had so far? Yeah, it's very important for us. Every game is important, but uh, this one a little bit special because we haven't been able to get over the line with Olympia on four attempts. So this year we're going to give it a little bit more effort like we do most years, but I hope to enjoy and, you know, hopefully to come out trumps on top at the end. How much have you studied your opponent? You know, all their games are available online. Have you done a bit of research into them? Not one single bit. The only research I do is into my own team. Make sure my family's ready and ready to go out and play. Not one bit? Not one bit at all. Not one bit of research? It's a pleasure to have them here at Whittington Park, to give uh, Whittington Park a bit of exposure, but that's about it. So I'm just looking forward to getting my team ready and out of the blocks. And then how's your side looking today? You're at full strength? As good as we can be. You know, there's always room for improvement, but you know, at the end of the day, it's 11 against 11. So we hope whoever's out there playing <clears throat> doesn't let the team down and does the job to get us through. Uh, Donny, big, big game. You have to get to get another BSFL team in Olympia. Do you know anything about them? Um, I, I know that they're a very good side. They've, um, they've won the Barnet League, I think. But I've, heard, I've known about Olympia for years. They've always been in amongst it. I think they've won a couple of London Cups, so they've been in the final. So they're a very good side, man. I think we've, been, we've got a tough draw here. But we're a tough side as well, so I think it makes for a very, very good game. Yeah, like I said, it'll be a very good game. Uh, you guys haven't reached this stage before. How important is the London Cup this season for you guys? Yeah, it's massive, man. I think, um, bar the Nationals, London Cup is probably this, the second biggest, biggest competition to win. We're from London, so to be able to say you're the best in London is a massive, would be a massive achievement for the club. So yeah, it's, it's a huge game. We know how big it is. Uh, the boys, we're here at 10 a.m. in the morning in North London. So you know we're taking it serious. Uh, you've been in great form, unbeaten in 2024. Right, how yeah. important is that form coming into a game like this? Yeah, it's massive, man. The, 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 the changing room is what wins you things at the end of the day. At this level, I think everyone's got a good team. Like, I'm pretty sure they're, they're a great side, we're a great side, so it's, you, need, you need something extra. I think the boys are in very good spirits, we're in good form, the boys are friends, that's a big thing as well. Um, so yeah, the form, I hope we can continue into today's game. Just got to win the game, I, I don't mind if we play bad, as long as we win, I'm happy. A few dropouts today, like you said, how's the team looking? Yeah, you know what, we came in pretty, pretty strong, uh, but then we've had three dropouts this morning, last minute, so RP7, big, big part of the club. Um, rolled his uh, ankle yesterday, he played yesterday. He tried his best to be available, but he just said he can't. He'll be a, he'll be a useless to us. Roar as well, done his Achilles, and TK has gone missing. So yeah, we're free short. However, we still, have a, we still have a good side. But yeah, it's Sunday league, innit? It happens, I guess it happens to everyone. A very warm welcome to Whittington Park for this London Cup semi-final. Olympia against SE Dons. Olympia in the neon green shirts, managed by Steve Sonotti, line up with Emmanuel Olajide in goal, a back four of Devon Holder, Rami Rifat, Adam Hastings and Elliot Joseph. In midfield, their captain, Larry Adjuman, Yemi Baremo, Larry Asari, Bediako, and then the two wide men, Rico Sonotti, Harry Filippo, and leading the line, Suleiman Zudo. On the bench, Giuliano Sonotti, Tashan Bradshaw-Brown, Joshua Smith, Giorgio Salangu and George Siphonius. SE Dons in the orange are managed by Ryan King Elliott. In goal, George Camarazzi, a back three of Daniel Carrington, Mohamed Kamara, and Briggs Ogerman. In midfield, well, the two wing backs, Ellis Ryan Brown and Nathan Palmer. And then Bode Anudu and Jordan Johnson Palmer. Tom Beer and Jack Samutis support Luke Adams in attack. On the bench, Nad Nichwa, Rory Hill, Noel Rayon McFarlane, Malarkey Robinson, and Toby Coker. Today's referee is Gerald Hall, assisted by Robert Kemble and Nicholas Harrison. The fourth official is Philip Chaikin. Olympia, the losing finalists in this competition last season. It's the well-known SE Dons. For the first time, they've got past the quarter-finals. 
Women's Cup competition. And it's Ellis Ryan Brown. Good through ball. Retrieved by Adams. It's a cross in, but it's well blocked. Right hand side, that's a, another good bit of defending from Olympia. Corner. Spun in deep, header down. And the second time of asking, it was into the side netting. The first shot was saved by Ola Gide, who then takes the goal kick. And up the pitch. See, Dons have made a bright start, but they've got some defending to do here in the sunshine. Across the face of goal, very dangerous. First real sighting of goal from Olympia. Devon Holder trying to get the ball down the line. This is a really good chance for Luke Adams, who's causing one or two problems. And the back heel, can they get the shot away? No, Adams, and it seemed to clip his heels and go behind for a goal kick. And a little bit fortunate there, Olympia. As the ball breaks into the box. Two defenders seem to collide with one another. Adams with a cheeky back heel. Does get the shot in. Samutis. It's really well blocked by Rami Rifat. Downfield. One in the air. Sinorti. Into the park. Larry Sara Beriako. He's given it away and misses another chance for SE Dons to get forward. Ellis Ryan Brown looking a threat as ever down the right hand side. Pulls it back to the Edge of the penalty area and the shot wide from Tom Beer. Swiveled, but couldn't get the right angle. <laughs> Cut by Samutis. <laughs> Put it on was Bode and Edu. Certainly had the better of the opening exchanges, there's no question about that, Essie Dons. But it's still nil nil, and this is where Olympia are so very, very dangerous. Down the right hand side. In comes the cross, and it will come all the way out, and it's just wide. Big moment in the game for Olympia. Don't keep taken long by Ola Gide. He's in here. This is a real chance, and taken brilliantly. Zudu was as cool as you like, and slotted it straight past the goalkeeper into the corner. Well, they've been second best up until this point, but that's cool. Cool finishing from Suleiman Zudu. Didn't really deal with it properly. And look at the way he nips in ahead of the defender, composes himself, shapes himself up, picks his spot and slots it home. Goalkeeper may have got a touch, but it was too little too late. 1 0 to Olympia. That's a big goal. It's just what Olympia needed. See Dons. Well, they've done enough in this game to have at least been level. It's Jordan Johnson Palmer from the back. And Tom, further still by Luke Adams down the left hand side. Samutis goes for goal just wide. Jack Samutis with the shot but couldn't get the target. Reaching out from the back with Mohamed Kamara up to the halfway line. Tom Beer quickly shifts it forward. It's a good ball. This is Ryan Brown. Hits the outside of the post. Rapid football from S.E. Dons. Point over to the left-hand side. S.E. Dons. Going to get forward in this London Cup semi-final against the Olympia side that lead by a goal to nil and they're looking for more hungry for it but the shot was saved they've only lost two in all competitions this season Olympia shock exit just a couple of weeks ago in the Roger Jones Challenge Cup against Demonia Youth they're on the ascendancy here and they've won themselves a corner played by Harry Philippou in comes the corner goalkeeper just about reached it George Kamarazi and he shifts it downfield very quickly. Cleared away. Good defending from Olympia. They can send themselves forward very quickly. This is turning into a very 
eye-catching game into the penalty area. Asara Bediaku can't find the target. It'll be a goal kick. And the ball in the midfield, Samutis. Bodhi and Edu. Samutis again. Threaded ball through the middle, trying to pick out Luke Adams. Adams is chasing and a chance. Oh, that was so close from Jack Samutis. Thought he got the equaliser. It was just the wrong side of the post with Ola Jede beaten. Coming out from the back with Mohamed Kamara. Johnson Palmer, in fact, in a long ball into the penalty area. And he's tested again there. Ola Jede makes the save. is ahead of Samutis. Olympia coming forward. A shot towards goal. It's fairly comfortably saved in the end from Camarazzi. Sidons coming forward up from the back. Shifted wide again by Samutis, who's been very prominent in this first half so far. Once again on the ball now. Some Palmer, nice pass. Samutis, good challenge coming in to deny him a run on goal. And they've turned defence into attack very quickly here. That's very strong defending by Mohamed Kamara, who stepped in. That's a good hold up play from Luke Adams. He switches it from the left to the right. Ryan Brown. To the penalty area, can't find the room for the shot. Tom Beer still alive. Samutis cross whipped in, came off the defender, but the flag is up. And the half time whistle has gone. And Silliman Zudu's goal on 14 minutes has Olympia ahead in what is an exhilarating cup tie. So we see Dons get this second half underway. Jordan Johnson Palmer wide to Off you, Rick. the right hand on, side. Go on, Silly, go on, Rick. Go on. Go on. He's gone out for a throw. Taken very quickly. But Amo gets the cross in. It's a dangerous one. Oh, on impossible angle. Johnson Palmer, goalkeeper Camarazzi with the clearance. He wasn't the greatest of clearances. Not their way forward of Olympia. Can they make the most of the opportunity? Low driven ball in. It was a really good ball in as well. No one there. Getting out from the back with Anidu. Over to the left hand side, Palmer. Inside from Tom Beer. Bodhi Anida again. Played out to the right hand side. And it's Ryan Brown. Chance to run at Elliot Joseph. Gets the cross in. It's slammed away. Samutis. Another high ball into the penalty area. It's nice clearance, but there's back up for Olympia. It might be 1 0 up Olympia, but they happen to work hard for this one. And they're going for the return. There was a little shirt pole there, which the referee spotted and gives the penalty. It's a good spot by referee Gerald Holt. So you see Dons entered the penalty area. You can see here there is a clear shirt pull. And Mohamed Kamara. The referee wasted no time in pointing to the spot. From the spot, neatly taken, it's 1-1. One, one. Nathan Palmer with the goal. And it's no more than they deserve. The club's all-time top goal scorer was as cool as you like from the penalty spot. And they are level at 1-1. One, one. And this cup tie is once again right in the balance. Very calm penalty, sent the goalkeeper the wrong way, right into the corner. Didn't let the pressure get to him there. Of 
have already tied up the BSFL Premier Division Championship 16 points clear but they would love a cup final to go with it and they were very nearly in again there good goalkeeping point from uh, Kamarasi and it cleared away by Anidu it's a throw in on the far side carried through from the midfield and the through ball takes it in his stride it's a big chance for Suleiman Zudu but he couldn't take his second goal of the game the title 16 points clear they've already wrapped up the title they were championship champions last season by clear 18 points certainly now to win the league with some to spare do Olympia can they negotiate a very tricky semi-final here it's in the balance SE Dons coming forward in their numbers Samutis it's a real talent Samutis wide to Palmer whips it in and it's just wide long downfield never won this competition SC Dons number one YouTube team with a quarter of a million followers Be on the edge of the seats at the moment as they come working their way forward and Udu to the penalty area for Adams and there's the shot and a goal again from Nathan Palmer well he's their go-to man isn't he and the celebrations are big. The club's record goal scorer has chipped in with two crucial goals to tip this semi final in favour of the SE Dons. And Edu was big in the goal itself. And helped on. And a brilliant finish from Palmer. With the good work from Tom Beer. the back is Rory Hill That's kind of like. and back in the midfield and then lost again lost by Zara Bediaco into the penalty area chance here for Palmer he's on a hat trick he's got the flavour there's Nathan Palmer two to beat goes down referee's not interested this time in giving the penalty Olympia are able to clear their lines and they clear their lines well. It's a chance for Suleiman Zudu to get forward. He's won a free kick. This could be within shooting range. And it is, but sadly for Olympia, high over the top of the crossbar. Two goals in seven minutes from Nathan Palmer. Let's turn this cup tight in favour of SE Dons in the sunshine. But it's not over yet. Back again in the midfield. That's a trip. That's a free kick. Foul on Asano Beriaku. It's a four man wall. Straight into the wall. They keep it alive, Olympia. Towards the edge of the penalty area. Headed away by Carrington. ball forward searching for it was Luke Adams but Olympia have dealt with it forward ball down the line from Buremo the Lions have been pretty solid at the back SE Dons up until now leading by two goals to one Olympia looking for that really important equaliser good play in the middle of the park by Sinotti and out wide to the left hand side this is where they could Perhaps profit. Got green shirts pouring forward. It's another free kick that's been won on the edge of the penalty area. This time it's a foul by Bodhi Anidu. Go for goal. He will. It took a wicked deflection and it's in. And it's an equaliser. Three minutes from time. Yemi Baremo scores a crucial goal to level things off at 2-2 and it could well prompt extra time. It took a wicked deflection on its way through. It came off the back of Luke Adams and into the net. 
and he'll claim it for Amo and he might well have rescued this cup tie for Olympia. This inside Malarkey Robinson but he couldn't control and they're going for the win here. It was a shot from some way out from Baremo. The side particularly wants extra time. Can they win it in the 90? It's a curling effort towards goal. It's from Rory Hill. It was a comfortable save from Ola Gide. Gide with a long clearance forward. Straight over the top. And back. Well, by uh, yeah, S.E. Dons. That's a push in the back. That's a free kick. It's a foul on Asano Beriaco. Into the penalty area. Powerful header straight at the goalkeeper. It's been a really absorbing game, this one. No question about that. To the penalty area. Slotted away, only partially cleared. Shot coming in. That's been blocked too. Hands to the pump at the back from Olympia at the moment. This is Anidu to the penalty area again. Cleared away up towards the halfway line. Let's see Dons will go once more. There's a great crowd here at Whittington Park and they would have thoroughly enjoyed that 90 minutes. I don't think they'll be too disappointed that there's another 30 minutes to come because this has been an excellent cup tie thus far. 2-2 at 90 minutes. It's Olympia to get this extra 30 minutes underway. And the header from Kamara. Tended back for his goalkeeper. Johnson Palmer. Ball inside from Nathan Palmer. His two goals swung the cup tie in favour of S.E. Dons in the second half. It's a great turn. And he unleashes a shot from distance and it was a comfortable save in the end from Olegide. Emmanuel Olegide in goal for Olympia. Steve Sinotti's side looking to go one better in his competition having lost the final last season. They're coming forward now in their numbers. It's a Powerful run into the penalty area. Can he get the shot away? Just couldn't quite get the power on it. Zudu. Twisting and turning and trying to make something happen was Nathan Palmer. Into the feet of Rory Hill. Into the penalty area here. S.E. Don's ball comes in. It's cleared away. Shot. Well, he's taken a slight deflection from Jordan Johnson Palmer, saved by Olajide, who then clears long downfield. Back by Ned Mutua. But there's a chance, and again, it's strong defending by Mo Kamara. Appeals from the Olympia players who felt there was a foul there. Get to have another look at this. Strong play in the midfield, and then the through ball. Is this a foul? He's gone in strong. He didn't see enough to merit giving a free kick or even a penalty. Kick forward by Alajide. Up in the air. Winning the second ball. It's been won back again by Nwitra. Free kick to see Dons. Taken by Nichua very quickly as well. Nathan Palmer. He always looks lively, he always looks capable, and he very nearly slipped that in. And that could be the winning goal, potentially. And it's Luke Adams who slots it home. Nathan Palmer, scorer of the previous two goals, was the instigator. And whilst his through did his through ball didn't quite connect. Studs in from the defender, took it straight into the path of Luke Adams. It was a Giuliano Sinotti interception that went straight to Adams and he slotted it in the corner. Free kick, a lot of free kicks in the second half 
on the edge of the penalty area. One of the free kicks led to a goal. Can this one lead to a goal? Curling effort, good block in the wall. It was Samutis. And they can break away as he dons with Olympia committed forward. That's good defending that free kick has been given. A yellow card for Suleiman Zudu. forward to the penalty area. Headed away. There is the half-time whistle. So 15 minutes for Olympia to salvage a cup tie. They've already had to come from behind. They've also had to deal with surrendering an early lead. Things for sure what happen, ever happens between now and the decision making at the end of this cup tight. It's been a cracker as another shot comes in from Olympia, but it's over the top of the crossbar. Throw forward by Asara Beriaco. Turned over his shoulder by Giuliano Sinotti. And Sinotti has been shown a yellow card for his challenge. Sunshine at Whittington Park. Let's see Don still had the advantage. It's not over yet. Olympia coming forward down the left-hand side. There are options in the penalty area now. Was there an infringement there? Well, claims of a shirt pull. And if you look at the state of the shirt that's being waved under the nose of the referee. You certainly see why. If the state of the shirt is anything to go by, then uh, yes, certainly that should have been a penalty and a foul by Jordan Johnson Palmer. A little bit of needlework might be required for that shirt. If we're not interested in giving a penalty. Be a long throw. Take the penalty area, can't quite get the flick on. Chance to clear. Clear they do, as he dons, but it will come straight back to the left hand side. Delivery into the box. It's headed on, but it's headed wide by Adam Hastings. Need to get the ball up the field to Olympia. Time is rapidly running out. Hastings over to this near side. Bremo given away though. This is where Essie Dons just have to keep the ball. Palmer. That's a way. is not a particularly good one on this occasion. But Olympia have it back again. Maybe a chance for one more Assault forward, they've won themselves a free kick. Free kick is going to be launched by Harry Philippou. Headed powerfully away, good defending by S.E. Dons. Not paying for the final whistle. Good hold up play. A long ball, sets them on another attack, Palmer. Palmer's done well. This is a chance, but an offside flag quickly raises against Ellis Ryan Brown. Free kick. They've got to hurry up here. Emmanuel Olajide. Put it out to the left hand side, but he's gone straight out. And there is the final whistle. And the dream of a second successive London Cup final is over for Olympia. SE Dons have come and won. They come from behind. And over the 120 minutes, They've probably been slightly the better side and they go through to the final. The London Sunday Football League Super League side through 3-2 after extra time here at Whittington Park against Olympia.